Hello everybody. We usually get a lot of questions on our page. These questions are all about the developer mode or the purple mode. Is there a real benefit of using this mode in diagnostic process? Do we have to use specific programs to be able to read the comments? How can I get the comments and orders and write it? How can I compare the results of these comments with another one and to know if they are wrong or right? Today, we brought to you a new program developed by iDoctor team. This program will facilitate the process and with one click, you will be able to detect the comments and compare with the right results. Let's see the program. Of course, you can use any interface or any program that use a command line to be able to write the comments on. For example, if you want to know the comments to be used to be used in the program, maybe there are something benefit and some things are not benefit. For example, we write help. As you see, you will be able to see a lot of comments that you can write and you can send it to the phone to get few results to for a lot of di diagnostics for example we can search for pmu adc where it sends the comment to the pmu ic on the iphone and here is the comment and how you could use it for example if you want to know how to use the pmu adc comment so you write help space PMU ADC click enter you will get a lot of sub comments that can be used with the PMU ADC for example you want to, re to read the main the best the all the comment is not easy you need to write a lot of things behind each others for example if you want to read everything in the PMU we have to use dash dash list dash dash read all uh, dash dash read best a lot of comments that is confusing to all of us for example let's use the first comment p m u a d c space dash dash read space all as you can see after clicking enter you will see all the outputs that the p m u exports to the whole the board for example if you want to search for for example, uh, anything about the CPU uh, usage, for example, BUC02, uh, BUC1, BUC0, for example, BUC0, which is, you will see that the result is by millivolt. For example, as you see, this is 900 millivolts. You go to the schematic diagram documents, search with the PMU, buck zero and then start you start diagnose diagnosing and make sure that the result you got in the document is the same as there but with our program here we go this program already summaries all the steps that you do by just one click of course first of all you select the com then select open then select open you can use any USB to URT or, or any boxes you have. For example, now we are connecting iPhone X. Here are a few of the comments that we see it is useful for any technician to be used and to avoid putting a lot of comments that are not useful. For example, you can use our program as a terminal. You can write help, as you can see, and you can start communicating with the iPhone manually. But the core behind this program is it is all about one click. Okay, With this program, we just click read all. It will automatically read the exports of the PMU IC on the board. And what's good about it is that you can compare the results you got with the results already saved on the database. For example, 
when clicking compare, you will find all the lines that you got uh, exported, all the comments that you got, got exported from the PMU, all the lines and um, connections, and you can see all of them are already highlighted in green, which means that the result is true. If you get the highlight by red, that means that this line has a problem or something wrong with the results that you need to get in, compa in comparison with the database. The report will tell you automatically that this line is having a problem by the red highlight. In the next generation, by clicking double click on the red line, you will automatically go to the schematic diagram with this line specifically, page on this line, to be able to start the diagnostic process. Of course, we can start. We already saw the read all. Now you can see the CPU bug. We wait for a few seconds until we get the message. Then start using the compare. Everything is green. <laughs> Thanks, God. <laughs> Also, we already we added a few things like I2C test. Of course, the I2C in the purple mode, there's a lot of uh, buses that are not red and there's some confusion. We already filtered to, to add the buses that we are not sure that these results is right. But that's not an actual read for all of the I2C. For example, I2C zero, as you can see, you just click see the terminal and then go to the compare. What's good about it is that we are going to tell you this I2C is connected with which IC, PMU, AC buck, every I2C connection or interface, we will tell you this I2C is connected to what? For example, he, he, here it's touch Abram or Acorn, as you see, to be able to start the physical test on the uh, board. There is audio test, of course. We are going to develop it more in the next generation. Baseband, power IC in uh, power IC for touch. In other models, it will be uh, with uh, it will be instead of the chestnut. So you could be comparing the results as you see here. For example, we let's take a line Acorn VN. We go to the schematic diagram and search for the acorn vn next generation as i mentioned before by clicking double click we will be able to see right uh, right right away to the pdf let's see for for example the vn as you see here is the vn let's for example look for the volt negative line in the schematic diagram here it is the volt negative line so by getting the result you will be able to start diagnosing here is the tegris test you can test the tegris ic and there is a comparison too as you can see this one is red means that there's a problem um I want to tell you that the program is still on beta version. You may ha you may see a few problems. We are not ashamed to say that, but we will be happy if you just tell us what problems did you see. You can test the three star and the battery test and the Wi-Fi uh, and the Wi-Fi unblock. This program is a gift from our team to all the technicians all over the world. Um, this this program is supported from iPhone six to iPhone X. We already added a lot of features. Uh, please try the program yourself, uh, and we will be uh, developing this program um, usually, and we'll be informing you with the updates. We will add the panic diagnostic uh, feature in the application in next generations. Uh, we we wish you follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and our uh, newly launched websites. Uh, thank you for your time. Hope we had gave you a few information.